Okay, um, I'm going to make a quick dish here. Basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to take um, some French style green beans. These are on sale at uh, Walmart. You can find them at a dollar store, etc. for like 78 cents a can. This is 14.5 um, ounces or 411 grams, so it's a little less than a pound. I've already drained the water out of it. I've got uh, chopped onion. I've got tomato sauce from the dollar store. I've got uh, a potato that I cut uh, uh, perpendicular to its axis. I've got some um, red peppers, some salt, and I got some olive oil. And I've got it on high heat. What's going to happen is I'm going to saute the onions. Sorry about that. Yeah, I know. Wacky, wacky video. Salted the onions. Put in some salt. I've got salt, as you can see. I'm going to put in the uh, red peppers that have been sitting in the fridge. And then basically I'm going to sweat these out, actually under a medium heat, for about five minutes. Then I'm going to pour in the uh, French style, it's got to be French style green beans, and I'm going to let them cook so that they'll soften a bit. I'm going to let them cook in uh, maybe for like another 10 minutes. So it'll be five minutes to sweat the onions and some olive oil and salt, and then another 10 minutes to get these things sort of uh, softened up. Then I'm going to pour in <clears throat> about three ladles full of uh, tomato sauce. I'm going to put in the uh, chopped potato and then I'm going to cover it with water and then I'm going to let it simmer for half an hour and that's going to be a very nice dish and I had the urge to do it and then I also said to myself why not video and put it on YouTube so that's what's going to happen okay it's been about um, it's been about six minutes I think the uh, onions have been um, Sweating and the uh, red pepper slices have been warmed up. Use your fork to make sure that the onion doesn't get the onions don't get stuck on the bottom, that kind of thing. Now I'm going to put in the uh, can of um, French style green beans. Oops, sorry, getting a little bit of a uh, steam off of the uh, pot. But I'm basically going to put these in. I've already drained them, but I'm going to put them in, swirl this around, and I'm going to let them cook for about maybe 10 minutes on that medium heat, uh, stirring every once in a while, making sure that uh, nothing gets stuck. And the reason for this is to make sure that the, uh, the green beans cook. And then what will happen is after about 10 minutes, I'm going to pour in about three ladles full of tomato sauce, the uh, cut potato enough water to cover and I'm going to let this simmer for half an hour and that's going to be it. Okay, yeah, I wasn't paying attention. Uh, I decided to check this and uh, it drank all the water. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to say, okay, it's been about seven or eight minutes. Not a full ten, but that's okay. I'm going to throw in the uh, rest of the potato, the single potato that I cut up. I'm going to throw in the uh, tomato sauce about three ladles full, I'd say. And then I'm basically going to cover this, cover this, with, cover this with water, and then set it on the rolling boil for about a minute, and then let it simmer. So, just enough water to cover it. Yeah, and we're done. That's it. So I'm going to bring this up to a bit of a boil, make sure that it's got some momentum, and then put it back down to a medium and let it simmer for half an hour, and we are done. It's boiling away. It's been about, um, gosh, about 10 minutes, and I can already tell that um, I've lost a fair amount of water. Eh, no, no, not that much. But every once in a while, you got to stir this thing. Make sure nothing sticks, make sure there's enough water.
um, you're basically reducing the water and giving it about a half an hour to do so. And in the interim, also, you're cooking the potato on the uh, French style green beans. Keep an eye on it, about half an hour. Everything should be okay. Got about 21 minutes. Yeah, it's thickened. I'm feeling a little bit of stickiness at the bottom. Gotta watch out for that. Oops. Maybe it's drinking the water a bit more quickly than I wanted it to. I think what I'll do is I'll lower the heat a little bit. You do get some splattering. You do get some splattering, so you got to be careful. I think it's another indication that I really should put in more. Actually, you know what? I think I'll put in maybe half a cup of water and actually put the heat back on medium. So I'll just, I'll just add about a half a cup of water. It's it, uh, I should have added more water at the beginning, but that's okay. Live and learn. I'm going to uh, turn off the heat and let this sort of uh, go on its own momentum for a bit. I uh, don't want to eat it right away, I want it to cool a little bit. So I'm turning off the heat. It's been about 43 minutes. And I can feel it just beginning to want to start to stick in the bottom. Actually, in a couple parts it has stuck a little bit, that's okay. But this is pretty much it. This is actually perfect. If you can see, you got your uh, French style string beans, you got the red pepper, you got the uh, potatoes. And you got that uh, wonderful tomato sauce. So this worked out pretty well. It's a nice little side dish. Uh, very easy to make. Mmm, hot. Hot. Should have used a little bit more tomato sauce, I think. But that's okay. It's fine. It's fine.